lot of um, the way that I present myself um, is very much in tune with sort of a more British ideology. Um, I'm quite reserved. I don't really, I'm not super emotional. I'm not very loud. Um, and I think that that definitely gave me like some good qualities, but I also think that having the option to also, you know, have lived in another country as well has given me um, a great amount of strength in terms of like independence and understanding current events and being interested in politics in both countries and just sort of feeling more like a global citizen as opposed to just living in one area or another. I was extremely active as a kid and I tried a bunch of sports and I decided I didn't like soccer, I didn't like basketball, it was all boring to me. And in middle school, I didn't make it on our volleyball team. I was really, really, really upset about that. <laughs> you know, 13 years old, like didn't make it on the volleyball team. But um, I decided that I wanted to try a completely new sport. And so I tried water polo, swimming, all of the typical sports. And um, a family friend of ours was fencing and I started fencing, I loved it. And I still haven't, I'm not bored of it yet. <laughs> and it's one of those sports that you can compete and fence and just be active in until you're 80 years old. So it's really, really an amazing sport and I still love it. Uh, last semester I was fortunate enough to take a class in ethics and a lot of the sort of um, business ethical dilemmas that we studied could align to sort of the way a team functions and in a sport like fencing um, we're a group of individuals with a collective goal not necessarily relying on each other to um, compete in certain competitions um, but we have to switch gears at the end of our season and rely on each other um, to win a championship and so I think that navigating personalities and navigating people's different like the different values that everyone brings to the table is extremely difficult but it's a very valuable experience um, I mean these are people you're training with some of the best the most amazing people in the country and amazing human beings and learning their values and learning what they hold dear and learning how to um, interact with them is it's an amazing life experience and I wouldn't trade it for anything